Hey there, Phil McCordy here with another science question. Is the Earth round? This one comes from Polly and Max who ask, is the Earth round? Now, round is the word we use for something when it's two dimensions, like a circle. And I think what we should talk about is, is it perfectly spherical? Which is the word we would use when we're talking about round in three dimensions. Now, of course, naturally the Earth isn't smooth. There's mountains and valleys and, you know, bumps and ridges and hills. But I think what Polly and Max are getting at is, if you smooth it out, is it a perfect sphere? Is it a perfect ball? And so let's take a look at the picture here. Now it looks pretty smooth, doesn't it? But that's because the atmosphere has a smoothing effect. For the ultimate in smoothing, atmosphere. atmosphere. But if we took away the atmosphere, and I am not suggesting we take away the atmosphere. Is everybody, everybody okay with that? I am not suggesting we take away the atmosphere. That is not a good idea. But if we looked below the atmosphere, is the Earth a perfect sphere? And the answer is no, it is not. It is what we would call an oblate spheroid, which, wow, that is totally gonna be the name of my new rock band. Ladies and gentlemen, we are oblate spheroid. One, two, one, two, three, four. You see, the Earth is spinning around, once around every day. It may not seem that fast, but at the equator, it's going 1,600 kilometers an hour, or 1,000 miles an hour. And what tends to happen is the middle starts to bulge out, and the tops flatten down a bit. And what you get is what's called an oblate spheroid. Now, it's not actually squished this much. This is an exaggeration, so you can see the shape. Thank you very much for your question, Polly and Max. And now we know the Earth is not a perfect sphere, but an oblate spheroid or a bit of a squashed fat sphere. So, if you like this video, please hit the like button, hit the subscribe button, hit the share button. Wait, there's no, sh there's no share button. What you actually have to do is take the link and then give it to a friend who might like it and then the friend will say, hey, this is an amazing YouTube channel. I'm gonna totally watch every second that's ever been produced of this YouTube channel and that band Oblate Spheroid sounds really awesome. Where can I get their album on iTunes? And then you have to tell them, no, no, Phil just made that up. It's not a real thing. And your friend's gonna be like, well, that's too bad because Oblate Spheroid sound like they really rock. And your friend's like, this is really great. And, and you're like, well, it's because I'm so awesome for sharing the link with you. Right, did you get all that? Good, okay, well until next time, stay curious.